What is up random person on the internet? RTG here, back with some more humankind. We are considering eliminating Solomon. Uh, that does not do much for us. It gives us a wonder, it gives us, well, it doesn't even give us these luxuries. because We intend to take them two turns. That should give us more than enough time to build the influence we need. We do. Well, her up, taking her up doesn't even give us access to the sea. Because. Yeah, this is just a giant lake. It gives us the Colossus. It does give us decent territory, which has at least one luxury. Okay, with Mahenjo Daro finishing this. What can you do? A decent production. Not much by the look of it. Okay, so you get to work on a stoneworks also. Venta is about to finish the iron mine. That going next. And I think San Lorenzo can get an obelisk down. Why is this 14? For Marco Squatter, Mako Squatter, research. Oh, the two Almaquettes, those are farm squatters. There's two food for it. Ah, that is fine. A San Lorenz Venta. Kinda want you to that after the You can work on that after the farm squatter, Madaro. Work on that for the stonework. Body ready, body set, and then it's turn. Have access to iron, research fortifications, walk and end. So we are going to start accumulating wall weariness to push these guys to the brink. This minimizes their spawn, their possible spawn locations. Instant resolution. Yeah, that is a pretty clean kill. You guys actually don't have that good locations to stand. Have line of sight. Guys are like right here. Don't want to move you. Terrible idea. Have an archer as reinforcements. And our immortals. Do get Bastion, so they are stronger when fighting from high ground or fortified positions. Extra plus three combat strength. You take this shot. Ooh. 
you can move forward. Slightly risky, but I don't see this fight going past this turn. Battle one, you guys are going to earn. You guys are going to get that territory next turn. You head here. From here, we get the one or one. Okay, no, yeah, that is the plan. Too much movement to try something else. These guys aren't auto explore. Next continent here. Right look or it may just be solemn Gilgamesh is f almost finished researching classical era technology. So follow suit. I don't think we're going to get Siege Tactics done in time. Worth picking up. Turn. Quickly resettle this for 700. That gives us access to two luxury. We can move the outpost here for more food and more production. In fact, you also be moved. That involve change placing a canal network. I am opposed. You technically can also move, but that is putting you adjacent to the enemy capital while they are actively spitting out troops. You guys, I should have sent you this way so you could The Flooded Lands Part 2. Fortune favors you. Skies above Chenung grow darker and darker. The deluge, like a sea being tipped upon a city. Then, suddenly, clouds parted and the rains relented. Days of sunshine followed. Threat of flood is no more. Got lucky. Okay. Turn. That is an agrarian star. That is some fame and science. Um, influence and science. Okay. Need 600. Not 600. 800. 900. Okay. So we need some amount of money. And then talk. Do any? We are close to an estate star. Are close to a science star. Close to an expansionist. How close are we? Are you meeting? How close are we to a star? Oh, four more. So I doubt we got the next military star. Also, not looking likely for star. We are friends with Solomon, so can't hit him. Demilitarization. This territory. Four luxury sitting here. Okay. He at the poop end of this content but can we can move to the next era that is a possibility hey can't demilitarize his his territory which is fear he keeps bringing out the same army composition 
should keyword be fine. Okay. Ideally, ideally he would get rid of some of his get rid of some of his units for the next attack. New arrow. My emulator. We are very close to an estate star. Decently close to science star. I get an expansion to start. Almost whenever. You know what? Expansion is star unlocked. Settle boats here. Should get a garrison this way. Okay, you helping does not affect production obelisk, so need not assist. We are almost completely out of influence. Granted, we get enough influence for a policy change next turn. Demilitarize heal, less likely or less inclined to attack them. Still the wrong set of guys forward. Stand uh, here. Go this way. If we stand here, his attacks look significantly less appealing. How are we looking ability wise? Okay, minus 20 war weariness. Do have extra health regen. That is good. Let's turn. Moon lit sea. Just a few years, sailing has gone from a dangerous experiment to a prized skill among your citizens. Your shores bustle with activity, while ships can be seen up and down the coastline as they use landmarks to guide their way. Yet, some seasoned mariners have suggested that it is possible to navigate further into the seas by referencing instead the position of the sun and stars. What should a response to this proposal? I think we should. I think, and the numbers agree, we should collect information. We get stargazing, so we take less damage. Well, actually Swift might have been better. Fine. Go with what they say. This actually does change our access, so we do lose stability, which is kind of bad since we have a bit of war weariness. But we do get an extra 5% industry in all our cities and ports. Stargazing, we receive less damage from lost at sea, which for our Pentagon isn't really useful because it will die instantly, regardless. Two turns of monument that can get our so. right now. Okay, so Gilgamesh has a lot of and, and a lot of religious pressure. Not picking up any religious pressure that just might because we haven't seen any. Also, don't see any waters. That is a good. Fine. Oh, scratch that. There is empire over here. This empire is currently in third place, behind Gilgamesh. That is a rough set of 
people to have adjacent to each other. See if he moves his unit. So to us. Seems like he's not. Can. I think at this point. Safely attack her rapper. He's not going to lose nerves and has citizens, which are what you get from fortification, yeah? Yes. So he has fortification, which kind of makes sense since he has Giza, swordsman. So I figured he's that, that way along the tree. So, six citizens and his usual act versus a bunch of immortals and some archers. Which can't that up. That's hitting his territory. Instant resolution. It's like we win the fight. This is promising. To a third, a bit over a third of our units, including two. Yeah, including both of our upgraded them. We can achieve that same victory. I would not mind. You are fine. Think. Two swordsmen. Swordsmen and our immortals are almost ideally. Swordsmen, I would like to get like one flat ground so I can archers forward. I guess. This is as good a position as any. You guys don't like have line of sight. Do have line of sight up here. Swordsman can't get down. Asagizate. He's a citizen. He's all his Gizate are in the walls. Do not have Bastion. Uh, Oated Archer, we do not. Swordsman back. As many shots on the Archer as we can. On a river. That is less than ideal. Should have moved you forward before we took the shot. It's for additional uh, support. That looks like a move.
That guy retreated. We need to get rid of Archer. Highly importantly. You indefensible territory. Can't get you out of bank. But it's, it's annoying as it is. For the sake of experiment, I'll let you. Okay, it seems like the easy take can't attack me down. So without the archers, this should, I think, be a safe attack. Was hoping and we what did I misread this stronger attacks after the unit spends around defending attacks have not changed We are poorly offensive. Okay, annoyingly, you don't have a shot. A warrior. That is the end of our turn. You can safely go on auto explore now. And head back to Styra. You have built a holy site. With luck. This will secure tranquility the way police secure the streets. Aesthetes are unlocked. Science star next turn. Builder star still kind of a ways away. We have made no progress with the diplomat star. We are... Builder star is three. And we don't have... Any log, any strategics we can just pick up. Took this territory as kind of looking. This other empire seems to start, seems to have started making moves over here. What this? So that is the only other set of log, of resources seeing. Unit is lost in sea, so we can't do anything. Or we can't put it on auto. 
continuing this fight. If you can get that kill, we can take the flag. Excuse me? Have... Have these guys just always had a, a double shot and I just did not notice? Or am I crazy? No. Okay. Oh. That... Those were two different guys. I think. That citizen taken down. Attacked like I was expecting. Okay, didn't expect to lose that second javelin. I've gotten to the point of taking the city. Now the annoying part is taking the city. Just want like an extra archer shot. This around Okay, this is the last guy. Arapa taken. He lost two units to it. I'm already angry. Do not drive me to violence. So if we can Let's see. For surrender, we keep doable. We could vassalize. Getting our early on vassal could be useful. Getting our vassal of the person in last, oh, second to last, sorry, not as useful. We could make more use of his city. I think 
do just that. You are generous and well appreciated. This is a moment that breaks my heart. Gilgamesh. Oh, sorry. Solomon. As far as we are aware, it's left. We have taken losses of. Okay, you work on your support, but you flood irrigation, stoneworks, and take that territory to begin with. These guys and expand. Okay. Solomon has fallen. We are the Romans. I'm sure they'll be lovely neighbors. Don't let words like expansionist and militarist give you the wrong idea. Greetings. I'm called hot-blooded, short-tempered, passionate. All the highest compliments. As long as we are honest and fair, we can do mighty things. We have met King Tarquin. Oh. Oh, is that we have money? Yes. Tarquin is the board, the person currently in third place. We are a very a respectable seventh. We aren't doing the best, but has anyone first place has moved on to the next era? We actually are in the running. Who are also moving. Two guys up here. You up here. Uh, you guys get stability. Okay. We, can we bring you? That's useful. And get to here. This pentaconter is going to take a bit of babying. But, all things considered, we may be safe. Darn it, I was... Is that leverage, that influence over here. Okay, this is a weird expansion when there is a territory with marble right there. But... It's been a productive episode so far. We are now up to our fifth city, losing 120 influence per turn and still making over 100. Technology. Okay, siege tactics is almost done. Technology wise, don't get an extra pop unless we research theology. So, we are three, well, sorry, two kills away from our military staff. Good dress to try, like, I can be. So, we'll try that next turn. And if we are able to get those kills, we'll let the numbers decide next arrow. But with that, I have been RTG. You have been you. Peace, love, tranquility to all. And I will see you next time.